I'm in the centre of London. I've just arrived. We've just passed Tulse Hill, and yet again, we've seen another stabbing of two 15-year-old children fighting in the streets. I've given the police help. I've told them everything I know. How long can this typical situation continue? Where is Ken Livingston? Where is Gordon Brown? Why are they not stopping the youngsters from killing one another? This is a problem we all have to face. London, here we come. Here I am, Tuesday evening, celebrating London's fantastic culture. And this is what we want to maintain. Let me just read a little script from the brochure to you, all you people listening out there. The Soweto Gospel Choir, the choir are warmly welcome back to St Paul's Cathedral as recent Grammy Award winners for the best traditional world music category for their album, Blessed. Their program celebrates a double anniversary, 200 years since the parliamentary abolition of the Atlantic slave trade and 200 years since the death of Amazing Grace's author, John Newton. Now, these people show the diversity in culture, the diversity in London. Just listen and hear, listen to the beautiful sweet tone of these people in Soweto in South Africa. It's this diversity in culture we have to, we as a nation, Now this section shows my guest, Prophet Austin Moses from the Divine Ministries in Tottenham. And here we are, ladies and gentlemen, at the conservative way forward, the ever famous St. Stephen's Club. Come inside. Here I am at the Conservative Way Forward. Behind me you can see the famous St. James Park. My desire is to take it to the wire and see Ken retire. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, for all you viewers out there, I'm tired. Now, I've just this evening come through Tulls Hill and witnessed, as you may have seen on the video, another stabbing, another fatality within London. Now, I was stopped tonight just coming over Lambeth Bridge and my car was searched and it's comforting to know that the police are so on, ta on target. Yes, I thought, well, why me? <laughs> well, I, it was really comforting. Here you can see, ladies and gentlemen, for all you guys out there, you can see the stop and search certificate. Now, as I say, London's police are doing their jobs. It's up to us to help them to do their job. And I'll leave you with a comforting thought. Don't despair. I'm coming. Good night.